Content over by everything. My brothers, everyone, everyone that's listening now, yeah, just know that this is us speaking about incidents. So we're not here to debate or argue, innit? So we're here to just talk about what's happening. We have a right to do that. If anyone wants to discuss or etc. do that, there's always a time and place for it. But today we're not on that, innit? So there's been a time and place for them talking discussions, and today's not that time, innit? So today we're just here to discuss and clarify what's happened. So the brothers appreciate that, innit? Yeah. Uh, I, would, I would advise the brothers, anyone who is recording, make sure when you lot do record, no disrespect in it. So I'm saying no one disrespect in their titles. Because the thing is, people constantly record, brother, have your channels, record your thing, but don't disrespect in the titles and don't disrespect us in it. So if you're going to be a man enough to record us, be bad enough not to disrespect, go home and edit videos. Be cool, record the thing, put it up, promote your channels, no problem. But don't disrespect <coughs> in it. That's the main thing I'll ask for you brothers in it. All right, you're ready? Yeah? Sorry, what? Quit. All right, Bismillah, Rahman, Rahim. All right, so, brothers and sisters, we're here today in Speaker's Corner today, yeah? So, with my brother, Zan, Shia Blade Runner, I'm here with my elders, Sayyid Ali, I'm here with everyone today, everyone's here watching. So we've just obviously come today, like, after what's happened, we haven't come back to the park. So I don't know, for the brothers and sisters who know, or they don't know, two weeks ago, my brother came to the park and was assaulted, physically. He was assaulted by a group of people, innit? That come to this park. Not just a group. Yeah, you're talking yeah. about at least 150. At least 100 man. I got my boy Gabs oh. here as well. Mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying. Yes, yes. So it's about easy. Like you know, don't even need to ex ex exaggerate about numbers. 30, 40 man, easy. So you got my brother here. He's a 23 year old, and everyone wanted to be a big man that day, innit? Everyone wanted to be a big man when EDL came. So you know those ones where when EDL come, and you want to try it with another Muslim that looks at things differently to you. So what they come and done that day is is that the people that come and spread dawah, like, you know those ones, inverted speech marks, dawah, they talk about Islam. They wanted to come and try and violate my brother. Now, what happened was, just as a, as a mukhtasar, as in people know what I'm going, but anyway, I'll tell you anyway, is that, imagine all of us men are here now, yeah? We've got a number of people here, yeah? And imagine we're all on one methodology. Imagine we all go up to one guy that's on an opposing methodology and start asking him questions. Do you support Bashar Assad? Meaning that's such a politically loaded question. Like they all went up to my brother and the leader, the sheikh, the imam, mashallah, he went, in, he went to my brother and goes, do you believe in Bashar Assad? What do you believe about Bashar Assad? Meaning he's never asked that question before in his life. That day, he felt an itch to ask that question when there was a bagger man with him. Why was he asking that question? He wanted to politically incite hatred. Because you know those ones where we don't support Bashar Assad, but let's just say we did. What were you trying to do by asking that question? Incite violence. Incite violence because you want the man around you to be like, oh, cause a sectarian thing. When it's never been a sectarian thing. You man come to the park, you do your thing, we come do our thing. You want to discuss, we discuss. Why you got to talk about the Middle East and Bashar Assad? What does that have to do with us living here? Tell me. So when you come into him and say, oh, Bashar Assad, what do you believe about him? You're trying to be smart and incite hatred. Oh, you curse the Sahaba. Oh, you curse the wives of the Prophet. So hold on. You already know about Shia theology. So when you're asking that question in a bag of, with a bag of Salafi Sunni man around you, are you, trying to cause, are you trying to make them emotional and make them hate you? Because if you already know the answer, or you already know what we're on, or what we're not on, is that the right place and time to do it? Because what you're trying to do is you're trying to incite hatred. You're trying to make everyone, again, trying to, basically because of your, your disgusting politics, the issue is, in, in reality, the only problem is you. But you want to cause everyone to rise with you. That they eat the outcome. Instead, what you chose to do is, you chose to go to my little brother, and start asking him questions about like mad shit. That's if you've never asked before. To incite hatred. My brother then showed the tweet. Now the thing is, yeah, it's like, I'm gonna mention bear man this part today anyway, so don't worry, this video's running now. When that tweet was shown, my brother played the video. He goes, there was a video that was playing about Shia's getting killed online. One of their channels uploaded it. That's, you know, that's, you know those ones, that's enough to show what you're, what you're on. It was a masjid, let's be clear. It was, it was a, a masjid. masjid, it was a Shia it masjid. It was a Husseinia. It was a Husseinia, yeah, yeah. There was a shooting in the masjid, yeah, yeah. or the Husseinia, and you could hear little children crying. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. There was children crying in the video, it's very clear, it's available online. Yes, um, and they, one of them uploaded it on the video. Now, when they uploaded that, next man have come and started shooting up the place. With a bomb, shoot, whatever it is. They're shooting, I think it's more yeah, shooting, isn't shooting, it? Yeah. They're shooting up the place. When they're shooting up the place, what is a natural reaction for a human to do? If you saw that, bruv, without bias and without prejudice, no matter what, no matter what religion you are, no matter what sect you are, what is the first thing that's going to come in all the mandem's mind here? It's fucked up. You're going to say, bro, that's fucked. It's disgusting. That's fucked. You're going to say, what's that, bruv? Next man's are dying and you're uploading it. Okay. So already the channel's sick enough to upload it. And the title says this, 
when fake Martim turns real. For the non uh, for the non-Shia audience who might not know what Martim is, Martim is when we um, mourn and we, we hit our chests to mourn the death of the Prophet's family. So that's something that the Shia do. Now, when we're doing that, the title is obviously already inflammatory. When ma fake Martim turns real, meaning when fake grieving, according to them, turns real. So they're already mourning the thing. On top of that, when they've put that video up, Abdul Hamid comments on it. What does he say? He goes, when well, someone asks him, oh, like, have you seen that video being uploaded? Some next... One of his probably fan club mentions, oh, have you seen that video? He goes, oh, yeah, mashallah. What is it? What's may the exact one? May Allah bless the brother. Of course, bro. It's a of classic. Course, bro, it's a, of course, bro. It's a classic. May Allah bless the brother who uploaded this video. So it's one of those ones where, what does that say about your heart? Where are you standing? Like, bro, where's she, innit? Deal with it, innit? Okay, she, but it's clarification. Yeah. What was the clarification? The clarification was, now, this is where it gets pathetic because every man without bias, and the thing is, I don't stand here talking as, a, as, as, oh yeah, obviously I'm a Shia, but I don't stand here trying to make this into a Shia Sunni thing. Wallahi al -Azim. If that was Sunnis getting killed in the mosque and yeah, any man. of my Shia boys done that, I'll be the first one to speak against them. Yeah. First one, front line. Say, what the fuck, bruv? Children getting killed and you're talking about Allah bless the brother. Are you sick? So who thinks like that? For you to think like that and say, oh, Allah bless the brother, it means you're sick in the head. It's a sickness. You've got a sickness in your head. Go to the doctor. You know what I'm saying? So now when you've said that, you go, may Allah bless the brother. And he said that comment. Now his justification was it was what? Now, well for me, like there is no justification anyway. Yeah, but but you know what? Let's let's see, let's hear him out in it. Let's hear him out. Justification was this. First of all, he goes, apparently in that video, they're calling out to Yah, they're calling out to Imam Ali before they die. Apparently. I don't even know if they're doing that in the video, to be honest. Because I think that's another video. No, I don't think in that no, video no, they even call out. I think there is. One of the, okay, one cool. of the children. One, one of the children, children has called out Yah Ali. Yeah. No problem. So that's something that we do, innit? So I'll give you an example. If a, if a Christian is about to get killed in a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a church and he says, Ya Jesus, he, he calls out Ya Jesus or anything like that. Are you going to say, look at these sick guys? Or are you going to say, bruv, forget what he's calling out. Man's getting killed, bruv. He's getting killed. Like if your mind straight away goes to what he's calling out rather than to him getting killed with his family, you're sick. So his justification was, oh, when I meant Allah bless the brother, like there is obviously not, my, what I meant was, I'm just happy that they exposed themselves by calling out Imam Ali before they died. Like, are you sick in the head? He's the pet, the children or anyone in the mosque, they can call out whoever they want, bruv. You're no one. Yeah, yeah. Let That's any man call out whatever they want, bruv. Yeah. It's our creed, isn't it? It's not your creed. Nali Hadri! Us man will say Yali till the day we die, bruv. It's nothing to do with no one. And I'm a Sunni, bruv. That's a Sunni. 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 Get, that in the, get that in the camera as well. That wasn't even. Sunni, Sunni, it's Sunni. one of those ones where when Sunnis say it, you got a problem as well. It's Let the chant of the Pakistani it, army. It's, it's, it's the chant of the Pakistani Shia. army. Let it be known. The Pakistani army, who's not Shia, they chant it. So know this, that basically when Sunnis and Shias do it together, it's not an issue. When Shias do it by themselves, it's not an issue. You are no one to tell us and dictate to us what we can do, especially before we die. So now that that's happened, what do you do in the comment? May Allah bless the brother who uploaded it. So you're clearly sick. I'm targeting specifically Shias. What about other people where their mosques have been attacked? Or graveyards? Why are you targeting specifically Shias? As if Shias are the only people who believe in Istagata or Tawassal. Anyone who believes in Tawassal Even, even Sufis. Like, and, that's even Sunnis, and, and Sunni Orthodox. Sunni, so Sunni, so Sunni scholars of Orthodox, a lot of them have believed in Tawassal Istagata. And inshallah we can do a discussion, it's not a problem. Because a lot of men don't know this issue. And they talk about it. So it's just the one sect of Islam that's got an issue with it, yeah. a minority small sect that's got an issue with it, yeah. when in reality the majority of Sunnis believe in it. Yeah. And they don't even know it. Yeah. Yeah. Different discussion. But the point is, now that he's done it, he said what he had to do. My brother's then shown that, so obviously he's trying to bring heat to my brother. Politically inclined questions. Oh, what do you believe about Bashar Asad? Oh, do you curse the companions? He's trying to get everyone around him riled up when he knows that things are already tense. And this is the same man when we came to Arba'in, the Arba'in procession. Yeah, yeah. Last year he was surrounded by at least 40, 50 Shias. Not one of them treated him disrespectfully. When there was about 40, 50 of us in the day of Arba'in, the, 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 the 40th of the martyrdom of Imam Hussain, and we spoke to him, there was no hype. But if I come right now with my mandem, where there's remember, 10 of us... He, he, he was the same guy the night before who said, I'm going to go and give anti-Shia leaflets. leaflets. I'm going to give anti-Shia leaflets the day before the 40th of Imam Hussain. But if he does his thing, it shows obviously, his heart is obviously becoming exposed now, it's becoming open. I don't really like using that word exposed, too many Muslims rinse that word out. Expose, expose. It's just the reality, bro. That day when we spoke to him, bro, they can be, let it be known, I can walk into this park with 10 men, I can walk in with one man, I can walk in with a thousand men. My aura don't change. I am who I am. I don't change because there's man number around me. I don't need to change like that. I'm a man, you get it? I don't need to change because there's a bag of man around me. You, on the other hand, you had a bag of man around you, you knew what the situation of the park was, you chose to try and bully a little boy, young boy, 23 year old. So he's a man. Yeah. How old is the guy? So he's about 40 or something. 
So you're a man, bro. You probably has a family and thing, bro. Come on, bro. Like you, you, are you, are you sick in the head? So after doing all that, you do what you do. My brother says, you know what? You're coming up to me and trying to show me how I incite hatred towards Sunnism. Let me show you about you, innit? So when my brother showed the video, the next man couldn't handle it. He could not handle it. And the reason he couldn't handle it is because there's no justification for that. Tell me, brothers and sisters, in the audience, is there any justification for that kind of talk? No. No, no. no matter what sect you are, no. fuck it. So therefore, there's no justification for it. So therefore, if there's no justification for it, Again, I just heard something. Sorry, if there's kids watching it, try to censor those words out. Because obviously, man's a bit annoyed about what happened. Mm -hmm. If there's things, if try to censor it, these, these, the swear words, if your brothers can in it. Because obviously, it's not about that. The point is, is that you're doing these things now, yeah? The videos, you've, you've said what you had to say. My, my brother showed that he went mad. After what happened was, he's tried to grab my brother on the aggressive one. My brother's like, brother, I'm gone, innit? He tried to grab him on the aggressive one. Bear man trying to stop it. And it's one of those ones where I'm never gonna make, I'm never gonna let them make it into a Sunni Shia thing because there were bare man in the park that day that were trying to stop it as well. Yeah. And I'm gonna get to those specific people who I've got most respect for from that day anyway. So when he tried to stop it, my brother had has unfortunately had to go out in the field, didn't it? Because obviously of what's happened, bare, bare madness. But he's 23, Bob, and he's with, he came with like two, three men. In that video, I think he's about one guy. When he's gone to that side of the park, now you got bare man following him, and you got bare man following him, and you got him walking backwards and you got bear man following him. Now, if the guy, if Abdul Hamid was like a guy, it's like, all right, you know what, Bob, I can see this guy getting out of hand. He could have stopped it. He, he could have stopped it easy. Because he could have said, listen, back off, no one touch him. No one touch, listen, I'm stopping, so you man stopping it because you're following me, innit? So if I'm stopping, you stopping it. They, he, didn't, he didn't choose to do that. He chose to carry on. But there's no point of carrying on when you've got a bagger man following one guy. You stop, innit? If you're, if you were a man, you stopped, innit? You didn't stop, you carried on. My brother Gabs was there. My brother Kalam was there. Now. In terms of the park, in terms of what happened, after they got to a certain level, Gabs and Callum were saying, Zan, just stop, innit? Because you know how sick the comments are? Let me tell you how sick, mashallah, some of the Muslims' minds work. Yeah. The, some of the comments was, oh, why did he run? Well, I'll show you 10 men that will be on you, you run. Yeah. Let alone a bag of 50. Bag of 100, 100. There's no point in acting like big men on, bruv, these, these, these online trolls, wallah. It's like, <gasps> it's embarrassing. They embarrass themselves. You bring humiliation to you Islam, humiliation and to then Islam, you come in and preach Islam. You're supposed to be a Muslim, you're supposed to be a lion heart. You're tweeting online saying, oh, um, why did you run? When there's 50 men chasing you. Yeah. Are you sick? Yeah. They, Gabs and Callum and said, bro, Zan, stop in it. Because if you, if you keep walking backwards, they're going to keep trying to come on you. Yeah. My brother stopped. Now, Gabs, you say when he stopped, what happened when he stopped? Basically, yeah, when he, when he stopped, it's like, every time you got him to stop, people was trying to swing blows. And I could hear people saying, what, what, what's, he on, what's he on? Like, I didn't, I didn't understand. So you said that's like, a lie? Who said that? No, no, that's, that's a lie. lie. That's a what? That's a lie. It's a lie. So when I felt jabs to my stomach, you're going to tell me what I experienced. Nah, leave it. You can, you can say. Brother, let's you can say. Like I said, leave. We'll, we'll address that. We'll leave the comment because these men were there, innit? Yeah, we'll address that. No, but but my brother felt the jabs, though, innit? We'll address that. Yeah, yeah, gone. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, leave that. Yeah, leave that. Gone. Yeah. You can, you can say what you want. Yeah, no, you were there, innit? Yeah, yeah. So what I'm trying to say. Allah was watching the new man were there, innit? Yeah, gone. So, so with that. And you were front line, by the way. You were there. I was front line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So with that now, 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 yeah. I'm trying to stop, but these people are still coming. They're, they're still coming. So I'm like, you know what? There's nothing you can do. So he's having to walk all the way around to the point where another guy came by himself trying to punch him, and he fell. He slipped. He, he slipped on the snow. Yeah, yeah. He slipped. My brother's loafers. Yeah. He slipped on the snow, and 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 the guy was like going like he's going to punch. And I'm thinking, what is going on? Wow. But the thing is, the brother, the, the brother, and this is my point here yeah, about people's minds. Don't be biased. The brother's saying that's a lie. Now you're there. Now, let, let, let's let's use our brains. Yeah. You got one. You got one guy. Yeah, that's walking, and you look at and you look around, and it looks like a scene from 300 or Lord of the Rings, where how lions, many people are running towards lions, lions, and you're telling yeah. me, lion oh, hearts. that's a lie. Come, come on, bro, use your mind because I tell you that. now, Leave yeah, if you saw about 50, not even 50, I, I guarantee you, if if you saw five black brothers with hoodies running up to you, I beg you, I beg you any money, you'll be chipping, yeah. you'll be running, Nine, you'll take and that's not disrespect to you. Cut. That's not disrespect like, to you. That's for everyone. That's for everyone. Let's be real. So don't say, oh no, that's a lie. That's that. No, about that because today. I was there and I see what was happening. Well, he felt the jabs, There's bro. videos <laughs> out there where people was punch. You could see punches and people going, what, what, what? There's videos. Don't say that's there a was lie. a brother with a dog. I remember in the video as well, right at the end of the park. And you know what he actually said? He goes, "What you guys doing?" He goes, Tommy Robinson and his people are protesting there and you guys are fighting with this one brother. Exactly. So Gabs, so you were there. Yeah, so this is my point. So my point was, yeah, the, the main point was, this, especially when we got to the end, when finally, when, he, when obviously the police took him here, my main point, I took, I, I turned around to the Muslims and I was like, hold on. I was like, bro, this is, this, this is, this is a, this is a Muslim brother. 
regardless of your, you know, your difference of, yeah, differences. Yeah. Regardless of that, he's a Muslim brother, and all of you lot are running and chasing this one guy. For what? Over one, two, for what? For, for one for what? reason. I didn't know what it was for. We don't we even know for there, what. We have people there laughing. We have people there laughing, and, they, and I'm looking, thinking, hold on a second. Is this even right? It's, it's taking someone like me, who's not, who, who's not even a Muslim. I'm, I'm, I'm having to, I'm having to go there and protect this guy. And no one else ain't coming and saying, listen, brothers. No, 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 no. There was a few. A, a, a handful, handful. I say handful. a handful, yeah, yeah. but the, the majority, everyone's just there looking, laughing. Ah, like, it's a, like it's a fun day, like? Yeah, like, like, like we're in the circus. And yeah, I'm just Bro, right. is, he, is he Shia? Is he Shia? Yeah. Bro, they were oh, there, yeah. chase him, chase him. The thing is, that what he wanted to achieve, he achieved, didn't it? Mm. What he wanted to achieve was get the Shia, innit? Yeah. Mm. He wanted to achieve that. And there's people here who insult the Messenger of Allah, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And these people don't even utter nothing to them. They people insult, nothing. and people in, the, in this they park insult Allah and the Messenger. i never seen them emotions for that. Yep. Oh, you're big man for the Shia, yeah. but when people in front Allah and the Messenger, the curse Allah, the oh curse yeah, the no, we don't agree with that. Hold on, bruv. The way you chase one man, yeah. I never seen you chase next no, man no, for Allah and the been, Messenger. I'm not saying don't do it. I'm not saying do it, but I'm saying if you're really that emotional yeah, yeah, yeah. and you're yeah, sat no, that no, strong in your face, it's been brewing, hasn't it? Since you lot have come down, yeah, yeah there's thanks. been, uh, you know, so, so many years or whatever, one group who we call the Salafi Wahhabis have had a monopoly, yeah, amongst the. Oh, we're giving dawah. It's not giving dawah. They're not representing Islam or Sunni Islam. They're representing their, their viewpoint. Yeah, their They're representing viewpoint. their hatred. They're causing hatred amongst non-Muslims, bro. You know what I mean? Look how much hatred there is for you got against Kemet and stuff. But I got drawn into it. I just took a step back. That's why I haven't been to the park for quite a I'm while. I because you. I didn't want that hatred in my heart. You have to love everyone. Prophet Sallallahu said, love for humanity. The best of you Rahmat are the ones that love it. To Is he not humanity? Yeah. Is he not? Forget his Shia, bro. Forget. Sheikh Hamza Yusuf, one of the yeah, scholars yeah, I follow, yeah. he said, he's one of the respected you're going to say, we're going to not agree. You're going to have your you're views. Gonna we're going to have judgment. our views, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to disagree. Am I going to bring those sensitive matters that Sheikh Adnan said? Sheikh Adnan said something smart very about it. Yeah, beautiful. Smart about it. Yeah, yeah. What we say in the park goes to Pakistan, no, he's goes right. to Iraq, it goes to Syria. It causes a big issue in the world, bruv. So when you're talking, do you curse the compassion? You're trying to cause a political issue here. You're trying to cause an issue. Yeah. Do we come here and start doing that? No. Bruv, if anyone, just remember one thing. Every time my brothers come to this park, they've approached him. Just know that. Yes. Yep. If my brother comes to the park on a hype every week, I'm like, bro, obviously, like, you're on it, innit? You, you're going there, innit? They come to him. They come to us. So obviously, we're going to reply, innit? Well, Wahhabis hate Shias. That's the reality, no problem. isn't it? No, but not all Wahhabis, let's be clear. Yeah, yeah. There's but some extremist elements within, within the, yeah, yeah. the jihadi type. Yeah, yeah. There's the moderate ones. The thing is, the, to work now, 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 the thing is, now back to, what, back to what Gabs was saying now, yeah? When that's happening, when that's happening and they're doing what they're doing, what's sickening about it is, look, you've got the sick individuals that are doing what they're doing. You've got the sick individuals that are doing what they're doing. Huh? The message, yeah, in a bit, in a bit, one minute. They're doing what they're doing. A lot of the Muslims that are there, you got some guys that are involved. You got some guys that are standing there recording on a fun one. Mm. Like, tell me how sick are you all? All you dawah yeah. channels that were recording that day, mm. for you to record but not stop. Every dawah channel that was there, yeah. that calls themselves a Muslim dawah channel. How sick are you, man? That you record but you don't stop. What, you, to, to, get, to get your views up, yeah. To get, to get your views up. The views are important, isn't it? Get the hits. To get the hits. I saw them myself. They were laughing whilst they were recording. So it's one of those ones. How do you man call yourself Dawah channels, bro? Just say you man are here to reach fame, innit? Because yeah. you're recording while next man's about to get rushed and you're having fun with it. No, yeah. the same guys that chase me, do you know what they do next? Here's the icing on the cake. They came back to the park and gave Dawah. <laughs> <laughs> they came back to the park and started giving Dawah again. MashaAllah, you guys MashaAllah, bro. You're giving it Islam a good name, bro. Yeah, MashaAllah. The Prophet would have been really happy with you, innit? Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. The Prophet would have been free from you, lot. For you. Don't tell me the prophets from you lot. Right. What the prophets from this is what this is, this is what the prophet stood for. Never. I beg you, bro. Never. This is some ISIS mentality. Bro. Never. What are you talking about? And then the only people that were backing it were the non-Muslims. Yeah. He so acted what? more Gabs, like a Muslim. Gabs, Gabs acted like a Muslim that day. <laughs> Kalam for all he does. Yeah. I know my man don't agree with everything that Kalam does. No. But for Kalam was backing it that day. So how do you expect not to, for me not to hold um, Gabs's hand? How do you expect me not, for me not to be cool with Gabs? Oh, you're aligned with the Kufar. Of course I'm not aligned with him. I'm not gonna align with you, man, am I? The he same, backed it. The same prophet he used to dish to throw stones at, so and he excused those same people. Stop. He stopped it. He stopped it. Stop. Kalam stopped it. Isa stopped it. Isa stopped it. There was a couple of brothers. I'm not saying everyone was doing that, but there was a couple of guys stopping it, which is cool. I respect that. Just even a little while ago, I said to Hussein, I went up to him and I said, "Safe, bro. Thanks for stopping what happened to my brother," because I respect that. But just knowing that we all got families, bro, it's a sickening kind of thing you want to do. And my point to you lot is, my objective here is to do, say this. You don't want to play the sectarian game, you can play it. Or you can be real Muslims and say, you know what, no matter what, no matter who does it, it's wrong. Yeah. Tell what happened after the park, that day in the park. Yeah, yeah. You it's can be real and say, this is wrong. You can, you can be real and say, oh yeah, I disagree with this and be sectarian. Or you can be, you know what, I'm a Muslim. That's wrong, bro. Now tell me this, after that's happened, 
Everything that's happened. This is the important point. Listen to this. Yeah, now. yeah. No, which one are you talking about? That's it. The call. Yeah. The conversation. They, they, they try and phone. The audio recording. The, they, 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 they try and phone now, yeah? They try and um, they try and now afterwards, they try and make a phone call and say, oh, Abdul Hamid. Oh, like, you know, what's happened is you've caused problems for me. That terrorist comment is a problem for me. It's a problem. So we said, okay, how is it a problem, bro? So um, imagine my brother's nearly been rushed right now. He's nearly been rushed. I go, so how is it a problem, bro? Tell me what's happened, innit? Oh, brother, my family is going to be an issue for me. Bro, we all family men, innit? We all Muslims, innit? We all have mercy in our hearts, innit? So if next man's gonna phone me and say, bro, that's gonna cause a big issue. My brother just got rushed. My brother's saying, oh, no, tell me what's going on with your family. Is there a problem? Has, by what I've said to you on that day in the camera, has that caused your family an issue? Is it gonna be a problem for you, man? He's saying it is. We're saying, you know what, bro? If there's gonna be that much of an issue, and the thing is, he tried to do it in a smart way. Man, try and mention where I work. He's got the audio oh, recording hey, on his phone. My man tried to mention where I work. He's oh, got man the knows where you work. recording on the phone as well. So I was like, so are we going from the angle of Threatening or are we coming from the angle of we're brothers? What are we doing here? Because it sounds like you're trying to do indirect threats here. Oh, we've got a video of you going to this protest uh, uh, with Bin Laden back in the day and people's Bin Laden's name was mentioned. Oh. I was like, okay, so what are you trying to prove here, bro? Are you trying to threaten, man? That shit don't phase me, bro. Because yeah. yeah. I ain't going to enter hide. Yeah. Man's the last guy that fucking supports terrorism, but I'm a Shia, we get yeah, killed yeah. by them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm so the point is, is that now they're talking about it, I'm like, so what angle are you coming from? Afterwards, you reach the agreement where I said, you know what? If you want them comments taken back by my brother, yeah. if it's going to affect you and your family, no problem. What happened that day, accept responsibility, say sorry for what happened, as anyone would. Yes, say yes, sorry for what happened. Yes. And you know what, bro? After you've done that, I'll speak to my brother. And my brother, bro, my brother's on, on the phone. My brother goes, you know what? I'll take the comment back. Because I don't want to cause problems. After all that. Look at the mercy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. After all that, my brother and me were willing to say. And I said to my boys, listen, we're going to take it back because I don't want no one's family being involved in it. I don't want no one having problems because of the part. Yeah, yeah, Fuck yeah. that, bro. Nan's family going to have trouble because of a comment. Fuck that. Yeah, yeah. He made it. He, he, he fucked up by that comment. Say sorry, innit? Yeah, yeah. Say sorry for what you caused, innit? Done. What does he do a week later? He releases a video trying to justify what happened. Don't know if who's seen his video yeah, and who yeah, hasn't yeah, seen yeah, it. He really, so he basically yeah. broke his promise. Yeah. yeah. The Prophet said that one of the signs of a, of a hypocrite is the one who breaks his promise. Yeah. Bukhari. It's in Bukhari, yeah. A sign o always, of a hypocrite. always with the referencing, yeah? <laughs> a sign of a hypocrite who is one who makes an oath and breaks it. So you, you made a promise? Did he delete his comment? Which comment? That, that one? Is that one of comments still on? The one that he, that's the extremist Which one? Which one? The one about, um, that may Allah bless the brother. In fact, we delete, we, in fact, you know the video, the one we shared, the extremist comment, we even edited and removed it, we took it out. We took his name out from that We comment. were trying to take the name out because we're like, bro, this guy's experiencing heat because I know what happened with EDO and him that day. So we were like, bro, you know what, fuck you. We're not gonna, we don't wanna make this something, to, but accept responsibility for what you cause. Be a man, innit? Yeah. Be a man and be a Muslim and expect, accept responsibility. What does he do? He says that to us a week later, he releases a video justifying what happened to my brother. He's basically trying to make it sound like- and he puts another video of she is getting killed. And, he, and, and in the video, he puts another video of she is getting killed. It's like, are you sick in the head, fam? It's just wrong, man. You're sick. It's wrong. Your, your home methodology. And the, that's what I'm trying to say to the brothers in the park. Yeah. You, man, ain't got to be part of that. No. So when you lot think, oh, he's my brother, I'm from the same sect. No. You lot really want to play sectarianism, do it. Or you could be real Muslims and say, fuck that, I'm not part of this. And on that point, I'm not part on of this. that point, Raza, if you can't handle coming to the park, because you remember there's cameras because all the around emotions. the world, don't say anything. Remember when we had the debate? Who spoiled that debate when he was going to attack Sarah? Oh, remember yeah, that one? Yeah, yeah, Abdul yeah. Hamid. Who, who, who went up to Shamsi and nearly hit Shamsi? Abdul Hamid, yeah? Yeah, yeah? Who goes there with the whole EDO? Bruv, you know what? It's clearly I think an issue I, here, isn't it? It's clearly an got, issue, If it? you've got an issue it's here, bruv. It's clearly an issue, isn't it? You know what I mean? Don't make, and don't, don't try and rally up the Sunni masses around no, you. No. Don't be sheep, brothers. You're don't not, be sheep. Don't, 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 don't think that you lot, are, man, are like, you, lot, you lot are fulfilling some just cause by standing behind a man like that. No. Or anyone like that. No. When you see me standing behind a Shia like that, talk to me, innit? And don't make fake names online and troll people. <laughs> uh, we know who you are. We know yeah, who yeah, you they are. do that, bro. They, the uh, thing is, that's, that's what I'm Raza, saying. Let me say one thing, bro. I know I'm not going to hog this here. Yeah, no, but there's people that. in this park, I have to get this message out that people at home, uh, lay people, who think, mashallah, we're giving dawah, converting people. That's These are the same people that are causing a lot of problems for other brothers, making fake names, trolling people, messaging people on Facebook. Facebook. Muslims and non muslim There's women that have left Islam because some of the actions are con some of these dais, yeah? And they represent, bro, I know the stories. If you're in the circle, you know what's happened, yeah? I'm not going to name individuals, but they're not as holy as you think, yeah? No one's going to expose anything. But we have to stand up for justice. We have to stand up for justice. Sunni, Shia, 
Kemi, okay, whoever, whatever's right is right. Do you That's know what I mean? That's the way of Islam. And, and the thing is, you, you have you have a discussion. If you're not able to have a solid discussion, bro, you got mandem having issues with this Kemet law. You got sectarianism. Christians. What are you lot causing, bro? You think the world looks at like this and rates you, man? And who's who gets insulted? Who gets insulted? Who's insulted? Our prophet. Salah. Our prophet. Salah. 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 Constantly. Constantly. So. After he's made that comment, we've even tried to, so he's then broken his promise, made a video trying to prove what happened to my brother. So basically he's given a justification. So he broke his promise. And using another suicide. No, and no, doing, doing no, another no, video no. of murder. Bombing. So he's yeah. broke the promise. And we were still on a thing like, brother, we'll leave it, we'll let it go. But then after, you've, you, you've left us no choice. You left us no choice. After that, what was the thing, what was the other thing to say, Dali? It was, um, the apology. yeah, the apology. Now watch this. Now that's happened, yeah? It's been what, two weeks Two weeks in. Since it's happened, tell me this. From uh, anyone, you now you got all the big Dawa guys here. Yeah? I'm, I'm not sure who's here today. Inshallah, I'll speak to them if they're here, innit? You got the Ali Dawas. You got the Muhammad Hijabs. Because the thing is, it's about saying names now, innit? Yeah. That time's finished. Yeah. It's about the, hijab, about the Ali Dawas. And the thing is, Ali Dawas, Ali Dawa and Adnan Rashid, I actually keep in a separate section. Yeah. Them two I respect. Mm. So I will speak, I will, I'm going to discuss. Them two I'm more disappointed with than angry with. I'm more disappointed. Because them two are known to be the moderate academic voice. Yeah. So I'm disappointed in them, man. The other lot, you got the Mohammed Hijab. You got these other channels. You got everyone else. Tell me which, which one? one of them has condemned what happened. Single one of them. Any man went online and condemned it. Any man came to the camera and condemned it. Single one. Any, any of them. One guy that condemned it. If you ask them, oh yeah, I disagree with it. Bro, that's a fake. Bro, you know, you, bro that's not your heart. You know those ones where. Next man gets, um, next man has, you, you know, oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. they learn from the Shias, you know. Yeah. 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 came and how much you know, you know those ones where, even you know those ones where, when, uh, when like we, we, we came with about a number of us, 30, 40 man, oh, the Shias are here. Again, trying to incite, incite, incite a sectarian hatred. When it's not even that, bro. I come with 30 man, I come with one man, bro. Our aura is the same. Yeah. We don't come on a hype like that. We're not them characters. Yeah. Our Prophet taught us better. Sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam. So you lot, now that he's done that, no one's condemned it. Not one guy has condemned it. And what did they do? And now, now I'm going to go to Adnan Rashid. The thing is, about a month before that, Adnan Rashid, Hijab, they all had a conversation with us. Brothers, we should speak on a, on a good level. We're all Muslim. And I said to them, it's nice on camera what you're saying. Are you going to practice it? It's nice what you're saying. Wallahi, it's good what you're saying. But are you, are you not just saying it for the camera? Or are you actually going to practice it? And well, then brother, what happens is this. In fairness, Sheikh Adnan, he hasn't been here. Adnan, Ad Ad Adnan Rashid fairness, is one of those ones where I like to give him the benefit of the doubt yeah, because I felt like he spoke with sincerity and yeah. he's an academic. Yeah. Yeah. But regardless, everyone sees that shit online, and Saracen. Everyone can make a quick comment and say, yeah. I condemn what happened. Yeah. It's not hard. Yeah. I'm sure he will. I'm sure he will. Inshallah, he will. I have good faith. Now, even like with Ali Dawadam, they made a video the other day. I watched it. Uh, I think it was uh, Brother Isa as well. Uh, Black Isa. He's um, not the Shia one, the Salafi one. He's a cool guy. I've spoken to him before. And they had like a general conversation about, you know, the Muslim's character in the park. It's cool what you're doing, but it's just not right. It's not enough because I'll give you an example. Bruv, you can't, something like that can't happen. And then you give a general conversation and say, yeah, it's, it's wrong what's happened. Like generally the Muslims need to fix up. Bro, deal with the issue. Yes. You got to deal with the issue, bro. Yes. You got to deal with the issue and hit it when it's, well, who's the troublemaker here? Who's causing problems? You can't just be like, give a general talk and say, yeah, the Muslim, no, the Muslims don't need to fix up. Those characters need to fix up. Yes. It's not the Muslims. Yes, exactly, exactly. It's not the Muslims. Exactly. That's everything that's happened. Now, in terms of their methodology, this is what I'm going to say to you, yeah? Uh, before I get to this, there's one more issue. Imagine, okay, there's been no condemnation video. Agreed? Okay. No one's condemned it, no problem. Instead, Abdul Hamid made a video trying to justify what happened. Okay. This is the irony. Then you've got people from that same team trying to issue out a challenge to debate my brother. <laughs> but are you sick in the head? And you got under this. And guess what, man? And guess what, man? my phone me and telling me, "Oh, is your brother going to debate?" <laughs> I'm like, "Are you man sick in the head, bro? You man just tried rushing the other day." Have you seen the video? It looks like something out like of WWF. You know, yeah, like the guy, yeah, comes the guy, the camera, yeah, yeah, yeah. Speaks, he's got off. a fucking belt on and shit. He goes, yeah. Yeah, "Oh yeah, like, oh, I'm going to come and debate you." It's like, bro, what are you on? No, I'm coming to the UK. I'm coming to the UK to debate you, bro. Are you sick, fam? Keep your money. Go spend it on Hajj or something, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, go to Umrah. Go Umrah. Do something. Visit the Prophet. Yeah. Do the ziyara. Sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Go ask for forgiveness. Do toba. Yeah. You come. You're trying to say do it. You're gonna come and do a debate. Who wants to debate after you try to rush the guy, bro? Who is he anyway? So one of their team members. Oh, so so instead of instead of condemning the issue, so first you ain't condemned it. To, to, to try and draw away attention, yeah. you try and make a like a, a, a debate with your oh, we're ready to debate. But we don't want to debate sick individuals. Yeah. You're sick. You're mentally sick. That's the You're thing. mentally sick. You want to hear sickness? Yeah, now, now I'm going to show you why they're sick. I can't um, just... Can I just ask, you know that debate no, 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 where no, no, you wait, had wait, wait, with... Wait, wait, wait. Um, so, where there was the, the two brothers, uh, Mohammed Dijab had a debate. Who spoiled that debate? 
You know, Mohammed's hijab that's had another a debate. Topic, that's another topic. Did someone come yeah. and yeah, score that debate? Yeah, yeah, two people on our side. Yeah, yeah. Same guys. This is, and uh, my brother made a good point. Yeah, look, again, when I keep saying they, yeah, I mean his organisation and his and his methodology, because obviously there's a group of men behind him. Everyone knows what he's part of. There's a group man behind him. That's what I'm trying to say. The Muslims need to keep free of that behaviour. It's up to you how you lot handle it, bro. It's, it's from one of those ones where if, if that guy was a Shia, I don't have this allegiance where he's a Shia, I have to back him. This kind of false allegiance where next man's from the same of you, so you've got this tribalism. It's tribalism, bro. You've got to back him to the end. How, does, how, does, how is that Islamic? No. Islamically, bro, what's wrong is wrong. You say it's wrong. Simple as that. I'm a Sunni and I back you. Simple. Not because you're right. Because he you're right. He, bro, Saracen's clearly an orthodox Sunni, bro. He doesn't agree with my views. No, no. But, bro, we're talking it. It's we, we debate till we two, discuss, three, bro. We discuss. Night. But it's one of those ones we Listen, discuss. Bro, it. There's people, brothers and sisters, people's mothers. Yeah. Guys who come here to the park and still they respect the mothers. Yes. Despite the ideological differences. They yes. might not even be Muslim. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So learn how to. So you know, Islam, Islam, Islam's Islam about tolerance and it, it even shows you respecting. Yeah. These people try and mind frame, get into your minds and start making this narrative when it's not that. That's why inshallah if I come here with a hundred man, you'll see the same aura, bro. Yeah. It's not the thing is no one's hood here. I don't know why everyone starts acts act, act hood all of a sudden. This is speaker's corner, bro. Yeah. If you want you want gang warfare, go to the postcodes, bro. Go to the real ends and you'll see what hood is. Don't no one's Palestine hood here. Defend your Go brother, Palestine, then. bro. You want to yeah, see what yeah. war is, innit? Don't come speak us corner and try acting hood. No one's hood here. We're normal guys. <laughs> Everyone knows the guy. Do you know what I'm saying? No one's on that. So don't make it into that. Now, the same people that now, you know, they, so they haven't condemned it. They tried to issue out a challenge, how sick they are. And, they, and people are, imagine the mentality of people. You've got comments saying, why did Zan run? <laughs> like, but how do you reason with people like that? Why did you run? Like how do I reason with that? Next comment, oh, um, is Zan going to accept the debate challenge? So hold on, let's not talk about the elephant in the room then. Let's, let, the elephant's just, yeah, let's just ignore that guy. Yeah, he's just trying to rush him. Yeah, yeah, we don't talk about that. That was just a couple of young guys. Yeah, let's, let's, let's just leave that. You, let's debate now. <laughs> Are you sick, bro? Let me put that, the, the, the thing on. I'm going to show you the comment. I'm going to show you one thing. I'm going to show you something that adds to it because people will say, um, the and the thing is, Gary. Yes. Yeah. Gary. Gary. Gary and a Muslim. <laughs> Gary. We know his views on a prophet. I don't agree with his views on a prophet. One day, inshallah, we'll discuss that. But guess what? How Gary is the one who showed, in, he come to speakers and he backed it. Yes. And he mentioned it yes. when no Muslim mentioned it. Yes. Tell me all you Dawah channels, tell me anyone who had the guts and privilege to say, Bob, what, go on, what happened? Mm. Let's discuss this. No one. Mm. But Gary. And then when the Shias are soft towards Gary, oh, you're aligned with the Kafar. <laughs> Why wouldn't I align with them, bro? He embarrassed them. He went to the park. He embarrassed them. He goes, he and you know, Gary does his research. He had his iPad, his usual thing. He got it out. He started discussing it. And the Muslims were trying to defend it. Still defending it. Still defending it. Yeah. Yeah. It's a sickness in the heart, brothers. Eventually, yeah. eventually, they got to the point where they're like, nah, it's wrong. Yeah. It's one yes. of those ones. Yes. Once more. After in the end, they got to a point where it's wrong. They had to agree. Just about. Now, I'm going to show you one more thing that they've done, yeah? This group, yeah? Again, his whole methodology about his group and what they do. Abdul Hamid's group and their whole, you know, their whole little YouTube fan club. What they mentioned is one of the on one of the videos. They released a video recently. Uh, I think going to a Shia mosque. Going to a Shia, 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 Shia London. Going to a Shia mosque, buying books and mocking it. Like, yeah. again, I would love to see if Shia's done the same thing. How Sunnis would feel. Yeah. <coughs> no, if I went to a Sunni mosque, started buying books and start mocking it. No, Wabi's, Wabi's, Wabi mosque, bro. Not Sunnis, bro. No, no. But I'm saying, even if I've done a Sunni, you'll, you'll, you'll get offended and you'll be like, I was what's this, bro? Going to a Salafi mosque, a Sunni mosque, it's all offense, isn't it? You don't, yeah, yeah, bro, you want to go to the mosque and pray, go, go pray. Yeah, yeah. If you want to go buy books, go buy books. Yeah. Why are you making videos buying books and mocking a thing? Entering to Shia Center. Like, it's just childish, bro. What are you on? You, bro, I'll say you're a grown man, bro. You're acting like kids. Okay, they've done that, yeah? In the background, there was a Nasheed playing. The Nasheed that was playing in the background, had some lyrics that said kill the Shia. Hear the lyrics. Read the lyrics. Loud. Read them up loud. Wait, it said that in Shake the, the throne of the cross. It said that in there. Yes. Shake the throne of the cross. Kill the fire of the Majus. Majus is a derogatory term that's used against the Shia. Yeah. Hurry up and chop off those heads. Do not care about the enemies, do not fear the Jews. That comment was in the clip. They clocked, someone in the comments clocked it and said, what, what? you do realize you're, you're posting in the Shia that saying kill the Shias. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. these are the same people who say you can't speak Arabic. So same people. Well. So the same guys, like, they, they, yeah, mashallah, the Arabic is very good. Yeah, they the never, the apparently they never clocked that, I don't know. They quickly removed the video, they realised, but this is a PR disaster, isn't it? Because the thing is, there's one thing me speaking to you lot now, and there's one thing me, like I'm not going to go home and change my attitude. What I'm saying is what I am. So no take your hair, fam. <laughs> no take your hair. Them man said what they said, they clocked it because everyone was like, bro, you're promoting extremism. 
they removed the video quickly. People got that video, by the way. Don't they removed the video. Well. Said, oh yeah, it was a mistake. We didn't, we didn't know what they were saying. No problem. But then on their wall, why is it on the on the on the still on the Facebook wall? On their Facebook, Facebook wall, walls. the Facebook wall and the sheet still still there. Why is the why is the lyrics of the of, 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 the, of the lyrics? Gab, listen to the lyrics. Listen, listen to the lyrics. Shake the throne of the cross. Kill the fire of the Majus. Majus meaning Shia. Hurry up and chop off those heads. Do not care about the enemies. Do not fear the Jews. And then when we call you extremists, you get emotional. And they come here to give dawah every Sunday. And you're coming here to do dawah. Mashallah. Bro, li literally, you're, 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 you need to be locked up, bro. You're not well. You're not mentally well. I, I'm not even you're saying about in the, I'm not talking about in, um, in like mandem jail. I'm talking about like mental hospitals. I'm not, I'm not saying it as a drug thing. You guys, you they need help. You're not mentally well. Yeah, actually, I actually, that I'll make yeah. dua for you that you get well. Yeah. You're beheading not people. Well. You want to start beheading people. So now, and, and so they say, oh, we took the video off. We're fair, but it's still up on your page. So the point here, brothers and sisters, is that we've made it clear now, yeah? We're here today, brother, and inshallah we're going to keep coming, innit? Because this part's for everyone. It's not for a specific sect of Muslims. So you either deal with that, like you've dealt with Christians coming here, you've dealt with Jews coming here. This ain't no one's park. It's every man's park. Every man's park, bro. No matter what religion you are, it's every man's park. If you can't handle it, stay at home. This ain't about Shiaism. It's about, brother, your mentality, this mentality that people tend to have. So that's what I'm saying. On that day, bro, the love that I've got for people like Callum, people like Gabs, Bro, people like Gary, yeah. Can Ahmed Ali uh, come down after Hamid's actions? Ah, oh, I would, I would love it. Let's not put the let's not put let's the guy. Let's, let's, let's not put. An, I don't uh, want to. Let, I don't want to put. I don't want to. Say again. Don't give him. Don't give him fame. Don't give him fame. So nothing about the nothing about condemnation, but we want to go to Allah's gate. Oh, you know, you know, you know. So. Okay, I understand. I understand. All right, okay, cool, okay. cool, cool, cool. We're discussing. We're discussing something else for today. Today, that's yeah, another day, inshallah. Yeah. Shut up, bro. Right? You see, you see what I mean. You see after everything that's discussed. You see everything that's discussed. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. It's diversion. You see everything, brother. Don't you should not give him the time of day. Yeah, allow it, allow it, allow it. Just, 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 say, say what you have to do. Say what you see how everything that I've just said to you. Do you see why I told you there's a sickness? After everything I said, it's Ali or Great or Allah. Bro, what are you on, man? He's changing it. He's like not well, bro. This no, mentality is not. It's just not well. He's not mentally well. No, he's, not mentally. he's not mentally well. He's not mentally well. Don't no, no want him to say the guy. So the point is, just ignore him. Just let him talk. Yeah. The point is that yeah, now everything that's happened. Now you see what I mean? It's, it's just funny, isn't it? So now that everything, no, 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 quick on. Now that everything has happened, now that, now, now that everything has happened, we'll finish it there. But what I'm trying to say to you, brothers, don't get involved in the sectarianism. Have your belief. Well, if you're a Salafi, be a Salafi. Preach your thing. Have academic discussions, no problem. But let's leave this nasty hate mentality. Against you everyone. families, against everyone. Not it's only about Shias, Christians, against Kemet, Christians, chemists, and well. So for me, again, before I got interrupted, people like Gabs, people like Kalam, people like Gary, these men backed it. Simple, innit? They backed it. They backed him. That's what it is. They backed it, bro. Yes, you're right. I'm not. We don't. We don't have to. We don't, huh? We're not afraid of him. Yeah. But the thing is, we 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 don't have to be agreed with everything they say. But they backed my brother, innit? So we're gonna have love for it. I'm gonna have love for Gabs. Always. And Hussein as well. Always. And Hussein. I said to Hussein as well on his face. So Hussein, big man. Thing. I'm saying everyone who backed it. Exactly. Respect Hussein. Anyone who backs it, no matter who they are, bro, I back it. Yeah, I, 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 can someone like oh. anyway so brothers that's all I want to say today keep it humble keep it cool follow the sunnah of sallallahu alayhi wa sallam follow his sunnah follow his real sunnah his real sunnah not the sunnah of these other extremists his sunnah was rahmatullah alameen the mercy to, uni to the universe and love in it keep it like that yeah there's disagreements there's no doubt about it but let's deal with it academically and be and, and keep it civil in it and follow the real version of Islam in it. Not don't let it get hijacked. Inshallah, that's 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 all I'm saying today. It, Zan, Zan, you saying, uh, you, you, yeah, you cool. Think he said it was, uh, uh, okay, say, you, know, you, say, you said a long speech there and everything. But what what the main what the main point of that speech was is that Islam teaches humanity. Yeah. Right. We talk about Shia and Sunni. The reason why he basically that incident happened was because of a Shia and a Sunni. Yeah. Yeah. But the main reason. And the main thing Islam teaches is humanity. That's what that, that's what we basically yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically hit that, that, the main thing is yeah. about humanity. Yeah, that's the main I thing. Mean, yes. That's the main the thing. The prophet yes. came as because the prophet didn't say Allah in the Quran didn't say the prophet was here as a rahmah for only the Muslims. Mm. He said rahmat al alamin mm. for the world. Best of alamin, you are best alhamdulillah, of you. rabbil alamin. The same way the rabb is for the whole of alamin. In the same way the prophet is for the whole of alamin. Raza, Raza. The best of you are those who are the best in humanity. All the basics of the today. Yeah. Right. So brothers, keep it at that. Inshallah, anyone wants to speak, we can speak. Keep it humble. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Any success is from me, any success from Allah, any mistakes is from myself. So that's it, yeah? Assalamu alaikum everyone.
Come on, let's debate him, bro. No, no, don't, don't. Wallah, don't. Don't take any more. Allah, 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 Muhammad, Ali, Muhammad. He's in a bit. He's not mentally well. He's not mentally well. Don't, don't debate. He's not mentally well. Gabs, Gabs, don't give him the time. Don't shoot him. Don't, no one debate. No debates today. No, no debates. Bobby, he's not Sunni. Bobby. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. No lobbies. We're not debating. He's extremist, bro. We're not let's debating. Let's, let's, let's walk away from everyone. Let's everyone walk away from the truth now. Everyone walk away. I think he loves us. Big man, everyone recording. Big man, all the dial channels are recorded. Just take the Nasir what I said, didn't it? It's one of those ones. I said what I had to say. Take the Nasir and take it on board, didn't it? Give the brother his headphones. Coe, big man, take away. Man, say it straight. Man, don't listen to BBC. Man, don't listen to. Realize that God Almighty is Allah, and we. Okay. Is that answering the question? No, answer. The Quran is there. The Quran was crucified. We know how the appearance of Christ was crucified. The teaching of the Quran. Which means, if we believe these words, that Allah is responsible for deceiving the world about the crucifixion.